was knocked down and in some pain, heading off to the bench. Right side here, Bowie with a hill winding fire, hit the goal post. Oh, what an opportunity there, but Bowie rings the eye. Right side, Chris Bort. Again, juice to Travis Bort. Top of the left side, base off circle. Looking for that great A chance. Out front, there's a one-timer. They score! Paul Perry points in 16 straight. Make it 17 now. He buries in top corner. A power play goal, and it is one to nothing Bears. left wing side half boards with 30 on the power play up top to graves he fakes the slap shot still was in the way to camper with a slap pass across they got tipped but it's sent back to graves again who tees it up it got blocked comes loose in front they score it bounced free and Kanata tried to get over and just could not get over quick enough there was still some room and camper from the right wing fires it home the teams have traded power play goals early in the second period and we'll back and try the game at one And here come the Wolf back in the offensive zone. A three on two up ice. They hit the late man. A wrist shot, a left pad save. Kanata rebound. The Bears put in their own net. Kanata made the save. It went off of Paul Carey in the goal. Chris Summers will get credit. He's the one that took the shot from the slot, I believe. And then it hit Carey and went in the net. And it's 2 1 as the Wolf Pack gets some puck luck. They played it back to the near side pole. The left point. And we'll pack to the right side. One-timer score. Kanata got over but didn't get enough of it. Jensen fires it home from the right side. Kanata was there. It hit him, but it found its way through. And the Wolfpack have three straight. They lead three to one. Fly Carey tries to swing it out front under the body of Paliota with seven on the power play. Carey the left side for Boyd. Hops his stick, but Juice gets it right side Chris Bourne. Looks out front to the point juice across one timer. They score! Travis Boyd with an absolute snipe. 54 seconds into the third. It's a one goal game. It's three to two. Held in. Anti Oxiden plays it back behind the goal. And Matt Carey will take it, swing it out, but Oxygen scores. He deflects it past the blocker of Kanata. A great pass by Matt Carey from the corner, and the Wolf Pack respond. They're back up by two with 15.42 to go in the third. Fourth. Back to the point, Christian Juice. Tambellini off for tripping. Power play for the Bears. They didn't score in the last one, but they came close. They score on this one. Chris Clark puts it to the net. Liam O'Brien was there and deflects in. It's a one-goal game again. 4-3 with 11.20 to play in the third. Back ahead to center. Played in. A chance right up the middle for McCray and on goal. He scores. Hands it over Kanata, and it is a two-goal game again with six minutes and 58 seconds to play in the third. The Wolfpack just won't go away. There's to neutralize and bounce forward. And over the blue line, here's Walker. Back and forth we go. Because he's juiced and scored. Oh, the Bears aren't going away yet. It's a one-goal game, but once more, the roller coaster ride continues. It's five to four. to Chris Bull. At the red line, he'll drive it in. It hits the stanchion, pops up inside the post. It hit the boards, it came in front. Center, and the Bears lose in regulation this building for only the second time this season. Hartford has won two in a row and a huge win for them. They come in and even though the Bears stuck around, they fall tonight 5-4 to the Wolfpack here, the Giants.